Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm gonna be doing a Halloween makeup look and today is gonna be the first video of the many videos to come for the Halloween week It's a trend that every youtuber does around this time and basically what it is is throughout the whole week until Halloween day They upload a video for you guys with makeup looks um, Usually simple fast and ready just in case you're running out of ideas today I'm gonna be teaching you guys or showing you guys how to do a pumpkin look for you to go out tricky trading with your friends, family, siblings, anyone you want to go with, or any party in general. So, without further ado, let me shut up and let's get straight into it. Alrighty guys, so I have my face set already, like you can tell. I did my eyebrows and everything because today we're gonna be focusing on the design and the look. And for that, we're gonna go ahead and start drawing out the shapes of the figure that we wanna go for. And I'm gonna be using my eyeliner pencil in a white color shape. And we're just gonna draw the face that we wanna go for. So I'm gonna go start with like a big mouth. I'm gonna go ahead and start by going right here. Okay guys, so now that I have outlined what I want to be dark and separated the shapes, I'm going to go ahead and start painting this black so it sits and dries and then we're going to go with the eye look. For this product, I'm going to be using my handy dandy cream makeup um, and a black shade. You can find this at any um, makeup stores, they're really cheap. Um, and I'm gonna be using my flat brush and I'm just gonna shade that in. I'm not too worried about the outline being out of shape because we're gonna do some like cravings into it. Alrighty guys, so now that I have this, and I'm gonna add some like little lines to make the teeth kind of of the pumpkin. So you know when you carve a pumpkin, you have to use those teeth. I'm kind of basically gonna do that right there. So what I'm doing is I'm using the little tip of this flat brush and I'm just like drawing triangles. Like that. All right, now that we have covered the whole face with black, we're gonna go ahead and use a smaller brush and we're just gonna go ahead and add the orange and yellow right here to blend it in so it looks like it's actually part of the face and it's carved in. I'm gonna go ahead and use the Jaclyn Hill palette and the James Charles palette um, just because they both have orange and yellow but they have different tones of them and I just wanna give that dimension to this makeup look and make it look more realistic. I'm gonna dip into Jaclyn Hills and use the orange. This one is called My Man. I'm guessing that was his favorite color, orange. And I'm just gonna brush the outside to give that dimension. And there's that, that's how you create that face part. Now we're gonna go ahead and move into the eye shape and I'm gonna be doing one eye up camera and I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, I'm back and this is what the eye look is gonna look like. So I'm gonna teach you step by step on how I did it. All right, using the brush Morphe M506, I'm gonna dip into James Charles palette. I'm gonna use 518 and I'm just gonna go ahead and start using it in all the eyelid. Once you get to the outer quarter, you're gonna spread that out all the way to your temple. 
And once you get here, use circular motions to blend that out. Now we're gonna go ahead and grab the same brush and I'm gonna dip into uh, Rusted. I'm gonna tap it in in the inner corner instead of the outer corner, we're gonna do the opposite. So we're gonna go with the inner corner and we're just gonna blend it all halfway the eyelid. Now we're gonna take the same color and we're just gonna go ahead and put it out into the nose bridge. Take that color out. We're gonna go back and dip into 518 and we're gonna add some of it right here to blend those together. And then using a different brush, using the Morphine 431, I'm gonna dip into B. And I'm gonna use it to blend the top of the eye and the inner side. Just blend it out. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of my man from the Jacqueline Hill in the inner side to give the darker spot using the Morphe 506. Just like that, tap a little bit and then blend it out. All right, and then with a smaller tip brush, flat brush, whatever you wanna call it, I'm gonna dip into the same paint that I was using to do my face and I'm gonna create the wing liner and the little design looks like a little drop and whatnot. So I'm gonna go ahead and dip into it and then just draw the eyeliner. Don't be afraid to go out. Like literally go out. That's about to be the shape of it. And then just create the wing. So I'm just gonna go ahead and blend that in all the way to my inner corner. So once you have done that, you're gonna go ahead and use a the same brush that I used to create this line. So I'm gonna go ahead and dip into 518 from the palette. And I'm just gonna use it as my water line. Like that. And then you're basically all set. Let me go ahead and pop the lash on and then we will be all complete alrighty there you have it guys with the other lash on and then a final last step I'm gonna use a contour on the top orange like right here I'm just gonna dip into 518 again just create that contour top of my face And with a little bit of rusted, I'm gonna go ahead and create dimension right here. Just like that. Okay. 
Dimension. 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 Alrighty guys, there you have it and that's the whole makeup look complete for day one of Halloween day Make sure you guys go ahead and Subscribe if you're not yet subscribed make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you like this video this makeup tutorial or this makeup look in general and Don't forget to leave a comment down below. What was your best part or if you ever done something similar to it? Make sure you guys comment down below. I would love to hear it from you guys I'm feeling it. I'm gonna go ahead and do some photo shoots and I'll see you guys tomorrow for day two. Bye